what I focus on when I'm doing my uh, uh, receivings on the service is that I focus on having the racket as far away from me as possible so I can reach the shuttle as fast as possible. Afterwards, what I do then is that I focus on having the racket at the same position as long as possible, no matter what. So even if I'm gonna put it in the short uh, corner straight or in the cross corner uh, long, I will focus on making the racket look the same as long as possible and get as close to the shuttle as possible. Yes. And also, I have to focus on my grip and my elbow to make sure it's relaxed. I have a relaxed grip and a re relaxed elbow, so I have as many possibilities as long as possible. So if I was too stiff in my grip by my elbow, I wouldn't be able to make these deceptions very fast. I would have to put, make a very big movement in my arm if I had a stiff grip or stiff elbow. For example, if my, I wanted to make a uh, receive over there, I would have to be very movement and make a very big movement if I was stiff. But if I was relaxed, I could just do it in my fingers. And also, focusing on my uh, footwork, I usually uh, use my left leg to step out on, so I do like this. I do that because I think it's the fastest way to do it. I can reach the shuttle a, a bit faster than if I was doing like this. But I think, or I don't think, it's actually possible to do it either way. Sometimes it's better to use your right leg if you want to do a forehand receiver, put it on the cross. But um, I use the left leg because I think it's the fastest way and I just want to focus on receiving the shuttle as fast as possible. Of course, it's important as well to use your uh, non-dominant leg to, uh, to have a front when you receive the service because it's the one you push with when you want to go backward and flick serve. So if I had my right leg here and I want to get backward to, to make uh, the smash, I have to rotate my body and then go down. But if I started with my left leg in front, I could just jump down straight and make the smash. And uh, another reason is when I, if I have a turn here, usually you would uh, use your left leg to push to go backwards. So it will be a bit faster backwards if, I, if I'm on my left leg on the front. If I have used my right leg, I'm here, I have to rotate my body from there to here and then go backwards. So it will be a tiny bit slower if I'm not on my left leg on the front. Yes, and uh, in the forehand side, it's actually very much the same when uh, I'm talking about the footwork. I want to, I want to step, step, uh, make a step on the left leg so I can reach the shuttle as early as possible. Uh, it's also the same with the keep a relaxed grip and the relaxed elbow. Also, it's important that you make some space from your body to your elbow so you don't get too close. That will make it, uh, yeah, your mobility very weak. So I have to keep some space here so you can, your elbow can work.